Hi, everybody. Uh, I just want to say how great it is to see so many candidates running for office this time around. I think it's a huge step in the right direction um, as far as getting the city to a better state of affairs. Um, I, I mean, we definitely need to uh, expand the tax base. Not only that, um, by attracting businesses, that's obvious. But not only that, there's things we can slash from the budget right off the bat. Um, right now, we use about 10 to 11 million gallons a day in the city of water. And we don't really use this de desalination plant in, in Dighton. Um, but we give them about $8 million a year. Um, from what I understand, there were quite a few other solutions that would have been far more cost effective. For example, uh, I've recently learned that right where Plymouth Street is, near the police department, there's a cavern and a river that runs through it from the White Mountains all the way to Narragansett. And we didn't need to pipe all the way down to Dighton. I'm not sure why we didn't just pipe from Silver Lake to Plymouth, too. Um, if anybody can educate me on that reason, I, I'd love to hear about it. We also have wells under the city, uh, like the Kresge building, the old Kresge building, uh, has plenty of water under it. My house, um, for example, used to be an old bathhouse. And from what I understand, there's a springs up where the old Franklin School used to be that, uh, you know, there's, a, there's springs under my house too, from what I understand. And uh, we also have the MWRA option uh, that never really went through. Uh, I don't know. The, the desalination plant just, it's a scam we don't need, I think, you know, my humble opinion. Um, the other thing is all these uh, foreclosed properties, there's a lot of mortgage fraud. I don't know if anybody remembers 2008 when the six mega bank, well, the mega banks are not six anymore. There were more than six. Uh, they crippled the economy in 2008. And basically all those people that got foreclosed on, there's no revenue coming from the property taxes. Um, the, there's a lot of fraud going on in that industry. And these uh, courts need to really do something about it. I don't like how American jurisprudence right now seems to be um, guilty until proven rich. Uh, my name's Scott Hall. Um, I wish I had more time. Three minutes doesn't do me justice. I'm, I'm trying to get an extra minute here. Uh, but, oh, one more thing. Every Saturday, I will be at the Liberty Tree, um, at our Liberty Tree on High Street, also known as Frederick Douglass Road, from 4 to 5 every Saturday, weather permitting. If you want to talk about issues with me and rally the troops and, you know, make this city a lot better. Thanks for your time.